Hey, you beautiful React people. Now that Jonathan, the other one of the other uh, teachers at Boca Code, is streaming live and getting his sexy voice on, I've had to up the game. So now you'll be able to hear me in my video. Here we are, demo app. Wonderful. Fantastic. You're not impressed? Let me show you why you should be. Down here, we've added a single component that belongs to this example app. The single component is how you can share your content from any one of the websites that you're in. Right now, I'm on a website that's a demo one called react-share.search.sh. Let's pretend it even had slash users slash content number one as a special content I want to share. I have these icons and it will look at the URL, figure out what it has to do and share it over. If, for example, if I click on here on Facebook, a new tab opens for the user that's using my website and right away it has my domain with the information I wanted to share. We go ahead and click on the Twitter one, for example, and again, it shows my domain with text I've chosen to share. It works that way for Pinterest, in LinkedIn, and email. Unfortunately, we couldn't get Instagram, but that's the next project for you to reach. How do we do this? So if you want to go to github.com slash code slash react dash share, you'll see the project on how to do it. We talk about how to add it in here, but let's go into it. Inside the regular project, we're going to go ahead and go into it and look in the app. And we'll see, of course, that we're importing this one new component. That is the one that makes all the trick happen. The component just takes on a description, perhaps a description of something you want to share on that one page you want these icons to be at. The description right now in this case is hard coded, but of course you can think of like the description. Say you're sharing a list of cats. You can look into one of the cat's pages, and when you have the description of the cat, add it here as a variable. Now let's see what the component individually does. The component accepts the description and puts it in part of the URL for each one of the share points. The icons, the actual logos of the share points are built in. So no need to install any kind of drivers or icons or fonts or, um, you know, font awesome. And they're all built in. You can choose whether you need to remove certain uh, shareable icons. Maybe you don't want to share it to Twitter. Go ahead and remove it from your code. It grabs the URL so it doesn't need to be told which page it's on. It'll figure out exactly what it's on. So if you do do some uh, testing, be aware that some of the sites don't like for you to hold, uh, your share your local host. So try when it's up on a server. The website is, is uh, figured out, including everything that you see over here in the website. And then, of course, the actual uh, uh, description is coming in from that prop. And that's it. You'll be ready to go sharing your pages exactly where you want them by simply dropping this component and adding some description of what exactly the users see. Enjoy yourself. And let's bring it on. Let's put some more videos up here. See what else we can do.